Hey guys, welcome back to another Tech Guru video. Today we're in Adobe Photoshop CC and I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix or at least help blurry photographs within Adobe Photoshop. So if you have an image and it's a little bit out of focus and that's what causes a blurry photograph for the most part and you want to remedy that to the best of your ability, the best thing for you to do is to follow these steps. So the first thing you need to do is go ahead and open up that blurry or out of focus image within Photoshop. And once you've done that, go ahead and select the layer over here where the image is. And then once you've done that, go ahead and duplicate that layer. You can do that by right clicking on that layer and going to duplicate. And then once you've done that, name that layer, whatever you want to name it, and then click OK. Uh, once we've done that, you want to select that copy or background layer and it'll be selected in a different color there in the layers panel. And then once you've done that, go on up to where you see filter. Uh, okay, so once you've gone up to filter, go down to other and then go over to high pass right here below custom. And then once you've done that, you're going to see this dialog box come available. It's going to turn your photo into a nice gray looking photo. It's going to have a gray overlay and you're going to be able to see some of the lines come through there of the image. If you go all the way down with the radius, you're not going to see anything. If you go up, you're going to see more of the image. Go ahead and take that until you barely see uh, any of the lines. So I'm going to go ahead and move that over just a little bit. You want to move that. It's going to be different with different images, all depending on how large the image file is and just how large the image is in general. And once we've done that and you get a nice pixel range, depending on uh, the image, as I have already stated, go ahead and click OK. Once we have done that, we now want to go on over to our layers panel once more and go on up here to where you see the masking options here, okay? It's right here next to opacity. And then once we do that, we're going to have a few different options. You're going to see the ones that we want to use here are overlay, soft light, and hard light. Now, it depends on how dramatic the picture is as far as like how blurry it is. Now, the first option I would try to choose would be soft light. Now, soft light, as you see there, has already taken out a lot of that blurriness. If I go ahead and hide that effect or filter, you can see it gets a little more blurry. If I go ahead and apply that filter, it goes ahead and brings back some of that to the forefront and it focuses the image even more. Now, if you even want a more dramatic effect, and you gotta watch out by doing this, it, sometimes it actually overdoes it. You can go ahead and click on overlay uh, and you can do it that way and that brings it back even a little more and then if you want to go crazy you can go down to hard light and that brings it back even more it brings everything in more focus than it probably should so I would go ahead and you know sit right around soft light or overlay but if you want to you know go at it real hard go ahead and try hard light there so I'm gonna leave mine at soft light and you can see it's even less in focus there but if I go back up to overlay that's probably right where it needs to be. That's perfect right there on overlay. So again, guys, go ahead and add that high pass filter and then add a layer mask over that uh, as far as overlay, soft light, and hard light. And that should remedy, the, for the most part, your blurry or out of focus images. Now remember, if you have an image that is completely blurry and all you can see is just blurred lines and you cannot make out what the image is, you're not going to be able to remedy that. Uh, you need to make sure you go back and get another image if you really want to, to get that shot. So anyways, that is how you you remove or fix blurry images within Adobe Photoshop. I hope this video helped you out. Go ahead and help me out by hitting that like button down below. Subscribe to my channel for more great content just like this, and I will see you guys next time.